Hey everyone, it's Antagonist Kim, and we're back with Paleo Pines. We have a new little buddy. Bait. I'll pet you. Alright, so, um, we need to build them a pin. We have them a little dream stone already, because I did collect a couple when I was out. I don't recall where I started the day at. It's midday. Okay. So he might actually be really tired right now. I mean, his stamina is alright, but we gotta go into town, so. Those are, yeah, those are still watered, so we're good. I don't remember how much money I have, to be honest, but we gotta buy some more gates. I'm not sure how to craft them, you know? Or at least I, I have yet to get the means to craft them, so. We will have to do that. But yeah, it was pretty sweet. We, like, got our first, like, flute sesh going on and recruited our first dino. It's great. Mm. Take this. You've earned it. Oh, yeah, that was for the fiber quest. Okay. And actually, speaking of that, um, of course he's not there. Um, let's see. Can I see my other dinos here? Oh, here. Oh, I need to make a feed bin too. So yeah, I need to, uh... I need to find a... Oh, yeah, I've returned to Owen. So wait, what was that thing I just gave him? I gave him fiber? Where'd he just go? Darn it. There you are. I have more stuff to give you, dude. Mm. Okay. Is that it? Oh, why is my camera being crazy? Stop it. Okay. Marlo, dude, I need you here. Where are you? Ooh, someone's up there. Oh, the pop the poppins. We got the little biscuit things last episode. Welcome back to Pebble Plaza. I don't think you met Pippin last time you were here. Pippin, this is Kim. Hello, Pippin. Pippin makes poppins. Uh, yes, I make poppins. There, so you can see them. Poppins are like little cakes. Uh, excuse me, they are not like little cakes, Marlo. Poppins are cultural tradition from an age-old family recipe. Tell me something, Kim. Would you describe it as a cake? Uh, how would you describe a cake? Uh, sweet. Exactly. See, Marlo, as per tradition, poppins are crunchy, dry, salty, chunky, and taste absolutely nothing like cakes. Thank you very much. My bad. It's been a while since I had one. I'd forgotten their uh, charm. Would you like one, Kim? They're really good. Uh, that's what everyone says. Uh, ask Mary. She buys them every week. Uh, yeah. Enjoy. There's no crunch more satisfying than buying it into a poppin. Oh, 100 shell. Okay. Uh, Pippin, Kim is new to the neighborhood. Okay, 95 shells then. Really? Okay, fine. I guess you can have just this one. Anyway, uh, that's a poppin'. If you need any more, uh, Pippin's got you covered. Except on baking days when my stall is closed, that's the only day I, I can make them. It's nice to meet you, Kim. Okay, nice. What's up, Pippin? What did I mean to cover? Uh, hey, Kim, are you here for a poppin' or two? Uh, oh, you're here to, uh, take that hat for Corlin for me? Thanks, that'd be great. Oh, a thousand, a hundred? I need to, I need to get the other stuff first. Okay. Let's go to Corlin. He was just down here. Give him his hat. Please feel free to browse and never know what you'll need. My hat! Thanks for bringing it to me. I was just beginning to think pu uh, Pippin had forgotten. Okay. Let's leave. Okay, now do I need to return to Pippin to tell him I did it? Oh, yeah. Return to Pippin. Okay. We'll do that. Holy cow. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay, I'm gonna go from this way with the hopes that it doesn't cover their face. Oh. 
Hey, uh, you look like someone who needs a poppin'. Poppin' anyone? Oh, here's your reward. We got two crunchy poppins. That's perfect. Believe? Okay, so we have three poppins now. This is perfect. Uh, what other journal item did I have? Investigate the path. We're growing the carrots right now. And we're still growing carrots. Okay, we're good. I wish there was a back button for this. Alright, let's talk to Marlo. Anything I can offer you today? Uh, between you and me, it's getting a bit rough with that path to Dapplewood blocked. Um, I'm doing my best to keep us with needs for the community, but it's tricky without my tools back home. My makeshift stone tools are really starting to wear out. Hey, uh, with all that clearing you've been doing in your ranch, would you have about 10 stones you could give me? I don't have that right now. Ah, uh, no problem. Uh, if you keep working at it with the tools I've got. Let me know if you have any, though. I'd be happy to take any stone off your hands. Okay. We need... Yeah, we need this. So I don't know how big of a pin they need. Um... I guess we could do 10. I mean... We need one of these. Um... I'm gonna be so poor. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, and a beating trough. Shoot. Um... Can I sell you these right now? It's only four. Hold on. These are only five. barely gonna make this. Oh my gosh. Hold on, because I need that trough. I, I don't know if I have anything else I can sell. Shoot. Okay, hold on. find more of these. I'm gonna be living to the edge here with this, uh... Next animal pin. We're gonna have to make this work. Okay. Good grief. Alright, now that I'm very poor, we're gonna have to definitely do some foraging and collecting and all kinds of stuff to make some cash back. Well, that and more quests, too. We'll have to definitely get into that. We'll head back home first. I know, babies. I'm gonna make you a pin. So we can make it happen. And I'll probably need a saddle for the other guy, too. What's up, little guys? You're so cute. We're gonna need one of those little Rammy dudes, too. Okay. And boom. We'll put you back in your pen. Alright. And can I pick this up? Oh, I can. Oh, okay. It'll be for you next. Let's build your pen. It's not going to be nearly as big and luxurious as his, but at least it will be something. Right? We also have one here, so this, this works out. Um, yeah, house builder mode. Tell me that's all I've got. Oh no. No, I still got six. Is it because I'm too close or something? What's going on here? Oh, there we go. Okay. it real quick. Where's the other thing? Nope. Wish this would just go straight into the other one. We 
have three left still. Let's set this up, though. How do I rotate? Ah, wait, no, 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 no. Oh, it's... Gosh darn it. Still getting used to this, guy. Sorry. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There. Um... Yeah, I don't think it would work. Even with three. Why won't this set? Why won't this work? Is it because this isn't- oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to upgrade. How do I pick this up? Let's place the dreamstone. Of course, freaking too close. Come on. Let's go back to this. Now will it let me do this? Why? Like, what does this one look like? Is it because the boulder's in the way? Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's take that out. Okay, and let's try this again. Maybe it's because it needs to be from this way, because the stone is in the way. Aha. Perfection. Okay. It's not going to be great, but it'll be something. And we'll put your feeding trough in here. <sighs> okay. It's really annoying that it does this. Oh, I'm still in it. Okay. Sorry. Put that there. Okay. And then let's fill this up. Oh, I have feed in the other thing. Now, I don't necessarily know how to assign... Um, I don't know how to assign uh, this to him, though. Okay. Bait needs a pen. Okay. How do I assign the pen? Did they tell me that? Twenty-five M squared. So it's not big enough. Okay, well, this is gonna be interesting. What else can I do to make some money then? What, what can I do here? Okay. Investigate the path. The carrots again, the carrots are growing and stone. What well, this name's really tired. Which just had an escape. Okay. Is it already almost nighttime? I mean, let's go. Let's use Lucky. What's up, Lucky? Oh, why are you in question mark mode? I mean, I guess before it gets too dark, let's go look around. Maybe I need to sleep for it to like transition and tell me stuff. Sorry, they didn't really give me any instructions, you guys, so my bad on that. Okay, um, ooh, there's Mary right there, so I was supposed to go to her? I don't know. Let's see. Hmm. 
Hey stranger, nice to see you again. Uh, Gala, I still can't believe it. A real live uh, Parasophilus living right around the corner. She's beautiful. What did you say her name was again? Lucky. Well, I reckon I'm lucky to have met you. You know, no one's seen a Parasophilus in the neck of this woods in a raptor's age. And I should know. I've been uh, to the tree line of Dapplewood all the way to the edge of the Aracotta Canyon. They're not gone. I've seen tracks, scuffs, markings, and other unmentionable evidence if you catch my drift. Uh, they're just, what's the word, elusive. But hey, who knows? Maybe Lucky will bring him out of hiding. Until then, I'm just going to have to give all my love to this one. What's Lucky's favorite food? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to say tomatoes? Tomatoes? I like those too. Kindred spirits, Lucky and me. Here, I don't mind sharing a few. Oh. In the meantime, don't be a stranger. Okay, um, can I give you this as a gift? Can I only feed this to you at the house? Okay, I guess not. Alright, well, let's hop on. So what did that do for my mission? Just to talk to her? Uh, I guess nothing. Okay. <laughs> Um, I don't want to go too far, because I think we've also kind of searched around some stuff. We do need to collect these. Absolutely. Look at the berries. I wish I didn't have to get on and off this thing. Some more goodies. I don't remember us going up here. We maybe did. This map is definitely a lot bigger than you think. Oh yeah, we haven't done this, have we? Oh, there's a Gami. Let's go up there real quick. So this must be Mary's house then? Because I think uh, Agami said Mary, she's staying with Mary. Click these. Other dino's not with us, so I hope that they didn't run away. Hey, listen, um, I'm always on the lookout for new seeds. If you have been to find any, let me know. Uh, okay. Anything new for you to say? I still need to pack or unpack, I swear. I feel like I live out of a saddlebag sometimes. Anything new besides this stuff? I think I've already written these down. Hey. Can I use this stuff? Huh. Okay, well, you know, I guess lucky let's head back home. It might be just bedtime, I guess, and I pray tomorrow someone's like, hey, there's this stuff, and I got things to help you build more stuff. Or here's a workbench to build the thing so you don't have to buy it each time. Okay. Ooh, I'll click this. At least the uh, uh, dinosaur feed, the herbivore food, is in abundance. Now, whether it spawns in the same area each time, I don't know, but I probably should keep track of it. Uh, let's head back home. I know, dinos, I want to collect more of you, but I don't have the pins. Okay.
Favorite treats are crunchy. Okay, well, please don't leave me, Fate. I need you. Let's save and go to bed and see where we go from there. Um, write in diary. And then go to sleep. Perfect. Okay, we got Owen. Hold on, it takes me a while to run over there. Ah, good morning. Sorry to show up unannounced. I was hoping to update my data on the Parasophilus. Uh, as you can s imagine, it's rather sketchy. Or is it... Uh, Parasophili. I don't even know the pluralization. I've never met one. Uh, never mind, too. Anyway, then I noticed uh, you've acquired a new friend, uh, Gallimus. Uh, and you've barely been here a week. It took me months to get Bongo to follow me home. Now, I don't mean to brag, but I'm kind of an expert here on the Gallimus. In fact, I've got volumes of information on dinosaur care. Some observed, much theoretical or uh, extra extrapolated, but all useful. Is there anything you might be vexing you with regards to the Gallimus care or dinosaur happiness? A pin. When caring for a dinosaur, their pin represents a space they can call their own. Uh, they like their pin to be a decent size compared to themselves and be fully enclosed. Well, not fully enclosed with a gate, of course. Um, and the gate is always open so you can come and go in the pin as you please. A good pin needs a place to eat and sleep and be kept tidy. Uh, you'll know what I mean uh, about keeping it tidy. Trust me. You'll need. A, you'll want a shovel. Anything else? Uh, the diet. Uh, just like people, dinosaurs can very uh, or can be very finicky about what, when, and how they want to eat. First, quantity. It shouldn't surprise you that big ones eat big meals and small ones eat small meals. Best to keep their troughs topped off. Second, basic nutrition. Herbivores eat herbal kibble, carnivores eat carno kibble. You can purchase both at Pebble Plaza from Coral and Stall. By the way, uh, don't go putting a carno kibble in a herbivore's trough. That's more insulting than not feeding them at all. Third is a flavor. Every species has a few flavors they like, and some they can't stand. Uh, for example, Gallimus generally likes crunchy things. Carrots, bell peppers, rhubarb, etc. Others might prefer juicy or spicy things. But individually, each dinosaur has a favorite food. Bongo loves garlic, for example. Uh, worst breath ever. Uh, I don't have all the answers for every dinosaur, but keep trying things and be sure to keep any findings logged in your journal I gave you. Um, dreamstone. I noticed that Lucky's pen already has a dreamstone. Dreamstones are a most crucial element to a dinosaur's comfort. Science can't explain why they love them so much, but they certainly do. If you haven't got one, uh, you may wake up one morning and find they've run off to find one themselves. Speaking of which, keep your eyes open. Dreamstones are rare in the wild, but if you're bringing home new friends, you'll need them. Uh, trust. Okay, now the most important thing you remember about living with dinosaurs is you don't own them. They're not pets or property, they're your friends, and it's their choice whether they want to stay with you or head back to the wild. The better you treat them, the more they'll trust you, and the longer they'll stick around. Uh, if they trust you enough, they'll offer to be your steed. In fact, uh, some might even like to help out around the ranch. They'll let you know when they're steed-worthy, but get yourself a saddle before you do anything like that. Trust me. I learned the hard way. Anything else? I'm good. Well, I hope you found this conversation enlightening. Um, I have one favor to ask, or perhaps you can accept it as a recommendation. Anything you learn about any species at all, could you please log it in your journal? Your journal is a vessel to new house to house new discoveries, learned preferences, traits, flavors, and much more. Use it often and you'll never forget anything. Plus, I may want to compare notes now and then. The life of a scientist is never dull. I see you've made some notes about Gallimuses already. Most diligent of you. Let's take a closer look at fate. Okay, approach the Gallimus with your journal in hand. Okay. That's it. Keep holding the journal out like this and see how fate is feeling. Okay. 
Uh, the heart is how much fate trusts you. The circle shows how happy they are right now. The happier Dino is, the more they'll trust you each day. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got a big day planned. Destination, my library. See ya. Okay. Um... It says you like crunchy. I don't know what you like yet, but I got to, uh... We got a water. Gotta water all these plants since I don't have your- Ooh, don't waste that. Since I don't have your trust just yet. So please stop. Fill up the water can, please. Oh, wait. Where is it? Uh-oh. Use the flute to ask her to follow you, okay? Lead fate to the pen. Okay. Okay, and then use the flute to ask fate to stay in the pen. Uh, three. Okay, fate looks like uh, you are all settled in. Okay, so this is what I need to know. Because, man... I was worried. I'll go check back tomorrow with a journal like Olin said. Alright. Let's water things. I have 20 waters left. Oh, I forget. I have to hold it down. Aha, there we go. Bear in mind, too, this uses up my stamina as well. We got a lot of stuff to do, but after watering, I might end the episode here, and we'll go into the next one and begin anew. Water these. By anew, I mean we gotta break up some more of this wooden stuff, get some money. Um, figure out if there's some kind of a workbench system, because... Oh, okay. Let's put that away. Um, we should give this to what's-his-name and see if he likes them, because... I guessed what he liked, but... Eat this? Do you like this? <gasps> Yay! You really like that tomato. Okay, well, I'm gonna pet you too. Okay, how is your food looking? Still okay. Let's leave it there for now. Alright, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. Um, I'm working hard to make uh, Fate's Cage bigger, just like Lucky's. And yeah, that'll be the goal for next episode. See you next time. Bye for now.